Hi, I'm Dave Swiger, the owner and master craftsman of Swiger Woodworks LLC located in Jefferson, Maryland. In this companion video series to the woodworking bench series I offer, we will be building this tool chest to fit into the trussle base. As an option, this tool chest can be built with all drawers as shown here. This video series can also be used to construct a tool chest for almost any bench that has lower stretchers in its base construction. If you need or would like to know more about me, please view Episode 1, Introduction to the Woodworking Bench Series. It's free to view. But basically, I'm transitioning into retirement and want to pass on what I have learned along the way to other woodworkers especially the hobbyist and novice woodworkers who have completed a couple of other projects and are now ready to take on larger ones with more challenges that will expand their woodworking skills and knowledge. If you are new to woodworking and have not yet completed a couple of smaller projects, please do not attempt to build this tool chest until you have gained some experience and have confidence in your abilities and skills with your woodworking tools and pirate equipment. There is no sense in risking an injury. If you have just completed the bench in the companion series, I want to say thank you for continuing along with me in this series. In this series, we will be using a joining technique known as splining to assemble the tool chest case. We will also be cutting finger joints to assemble drawer boxes, and we will be routing raised panels for doors and drawers, as you can see here. Additionally, in this series, for those that need to build a smaller or larger version of the chest, I'll be providing instructions and suggestions on how to do so. This is the tool chest I'll be building during the video series. Its overall dimensions are approximately 43 inches long by 19 inches high by 21 inches deep, and it weighs in at approximately 100 pounds. The key features of this tool chest include your choice of hardwood selections. Here I have used maple, purple heart, and American black walnut to trim and detail the chest. 3 quarter inch plywood is used in the case construction. It has three drawers in the drawer compartment, but I provide instructions how to add additional drawers in the video. These drawers are mounted on Blum Tandem full extension slides that are anti-slam and self-closing and have a 100 pound weight capacity. The storage compartment contains an adjustable 12 inch wide shelf. The storage compartment and top drawer are lockable to protect your most cherished woodworking tools. So please enjoy these first free episodes to determine if you have an interest in building a tool chest of your own, or if you would just simply enjoy viewing the entire series as a bystander. The biggest reward I can get is to receive a photo or two of your bench with this tool chest inserted. So please, send me a photo or two to dave at swaggerwoodworks.com. Then I will know the production of this video series has been worth my efforts. And besides, your photos could end up on my website for others to admire. I have kept the cost of the entire series as reasonable as I can. I have provided an option to subscribe to video streaming, which eliminates the cost of producing DVDs and their associated shipping and handling cost. However, I know everyone doesn't have an internet connection that will support video streaming, so I do offer DB DVDs, excuse me, but at a higher price. Just a couple words about safety. Please follow all your tool manufacturer's recommended safety suggestions. However, you will notice in this video I don't wear ear protection except at my planer. This is so I can hear directions and instructions from my camera person. I do need to thank a few people. First, my camera person, who is my wife, Brenda. 
none of my video series would have gotten produced without her. Secondly, I'd like to thank Terry Lunn of the U.S. and Sean Gavitt of the U.K. who have reviewed each episode as it was produced and are building tool chests of their own. Thanks, guys. Your reviews mean a lot to me. Now, please enjoy these first couple free episodes. I hope to see a photo or two from you soon.